back to my channel if you are new make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button make sure you hit your post notification bell so you can get updated on every time i post again you guys i post every monday at 2 p.m on the dot i schedule all my youtube videos so okay so you guys i am going to be doing a hair review on the joe deer lace front wig it's a 30 inch long wavy uh lace front wig and yes it is synthetic y'all i'm a this is what i'm gonna be doing i'm about to give y'all a lot of game on these synthetic wigs okay how to take care of them the whole thing okay so you know i got I got a couple human hair wigs, of course, and then, you know, I just started, you know, wanting to buy synthetic wigs, too, because, you know, it all depends on the fibers you get, and that's what people don't understand. Like, you gotta take care of every wig that you have, whether it's synthetic, whether it's human hair. So, I'm gonna let y'all in on a couple tips on synthetic wigs before I even get into the video. So, you guys, for synthetic wigs, number one, please, please do not sleep in your hair synthetic wigs I don't even sleep in my human hair wigs so definitely don't sleep in your synthetic wigs for two you have to wash the hair at least once a week at least wash your wigs at least once a week now if this is a wig that you just get in just because and you really don't care about it and you're gonna throw throw it away like the next day okay whatever do what you want to do but I appreciate all my wigs like every wig that I get I like and you know I'm taking care of it so please wash your wigs at least once a week third now it depends on what hair you're getting so with this one yes it's uh it's about 30 inches long with this one I don't I didn't have to use any shears or anything uh, because it's like a wavy wig so it's it's not too thick or whatever it's just right it feels like it's, it's about what three bundles of this in the hair um so basically um, all I did was when it came in I just washed the hair and I let it air dry let all your wigs air dry especially with synthetic wigs do not blow dry your synthetic wigs i'm just saying and they tell you to use a hairbrush mm, i don't really like using hairbrushes i just feel like it takes everything out of the hair when you use a hairbrush because they're they're so like they're so harsh to the hair so um i use i use a big tooth comb these are the type of combs i use or i use like the real fat ones and then i comb through the hair like and I'm not gonna lie, you guys, with this hair, um, well, I feel like with any hair though, you should you should comb it from the bottom up. This hair does tangle a little bit, so um, just a little, just a smidge. But you know, it's synthetic. Synthetic wigs do tend to tangle a little bit. But you just wanna, I feel like you wanna grab your comb and then just you know, just comb right through it. And so this wig came in dear box and what came in they say it's a 1b but it actually don't even look like a 1b it looks more like a one like it looks jet black um it came in with these eyelashes they're too thin for me i'm probably gonna double them with some more eyelashes because i like my eyelashes real like dramatic and then what i really liked about it is it came with this so basically to hold like when you put them baby hairs down yes shout out to y'all because i'm definitely gonna be using this with all my wigs <laughs> and then it came with a cap i actually have the cap on under this because i'm going to be showing you guys how i put it on <coughs> oh excuse me it came in with a nude um with a nude cap which i really like because when i put it on it wasn't too tight usually um some of these nude caps that come in these like wig boxes be a little too tight for the head so um that's what i really appreciate about this one um so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and put on this wig and you guys are gonna see how it okay so you guys this is the nude cap and I'm going to be using the Got To Be Glue spray bottle. Now, I just started using this. I usually just only use, uh, used to only use the black one. The one that you just put on your head and gel on. But I wanted to use the spray because I heard the spray works better and it actually does. This one holds your hair, I'm telling you. I probably spray it like 
twice. Like I'll spray it on my hair, put it on, then spray it a little more just to get, just to make sure it's secure. So, I'm gonna go ahead and Now you guys, one thing I will say, um, some I do brush from the bottom up usually, but since this is like wavy, I really, I can do it either way. Um, so look at these waves. Ooh. Okay, so, I'm gonna make sure the lace, and the lace lays really good, y'all. It lays really good. And I always leave just a little lace because I like to kind of see how it lays. Um, I'm going to spray a little more just to make sure it's secure. Then I'm going to... Okay. And then I'm going to spray the hair. And this is like the perfect wig too, if you just want to like get up and go, you know, and you still fine, you know, okay. So just wet it just a little bit. My spray bottle, y'all, you can get these spray bottles from, um, from the Dollar, the Dollar Tree, okay? Don't sleep on the Dollar Tree, okay? Okay, so, you guys, let's get in to, actually, let me lay my baby hairs. Hold on, y'all. And I can't really see on this camera, so I'm just gonna lay my baby hairs real quick. Give me, okay. So y'all, I just had to lay my hair down just a little bit, you know, right here. Just had to lay it down. I can't really see good in this camera when it comes to like laying my hair, my big little baby hairs down. Okay, so let's get into this wig you guys okay so i'm gonna have this information on the screen at the bottom so don't even trip about it so basically actually let me just say my friend daisy told me about this wig um she got this wig like a while ago but i didn't really like pay attention but i remember her getting this wig and then she has a picture like on amazon with it too so i'm like oh yeah i remember this wig so i ended up getting it so this is a natural black um wig from Jodir Lace Front Wigs, 30 inches long wavy synthetic wig. And it's 130% density. So they got all types of colors, y'all. They got, um, let me see. They got ombre orange, they got ombre blonde, they got um, a ombre blonde one, two, they got brown, and then they got red. Um, which I may end up getting a blonde one, too, but yeah, let's just stay on this black one. Okay, so this one, this wig was $38.99, and I do have the Prime membership, so um, it came the next day. I'm telling y'all, get on Amazon, get you an account. Ladies, I know you know, you know how we feel when we want our hair when we want our hair, okay? So if you just get the Prime membership, you will get your hair the next day. By the, by the latest, you'll get it second day, and they'll let you know, or whatever. So um, I purchased this hair um on september 28th and then i got it september 29th 
and um when it came in um it didn't stink or anything like that it was like really pretty it was really wavy the only thing i needed to do was wash it um and when i washed it you guys it was so easy to wash i used when I wash the hair, I use uh, Tresemme. I always use Tresemme on any wig. I don't care what they say about using some type. They say use some type of shampoo for for synthetic wigs. First of all, shampoo dries your hair out. So, no, let's stick to conditioning. If you do not want your waves, if you do not want your waves to be kind of like, I don't know, sometimes, sometimes it'll get a little mushed in. If you wanted it to be... A little just a little more wilder and you want more definition just comb it out it's not gonna take away the waves or anything that's why I said don't use a hairbrush I would rather just use a big old comb because I feel like the comb it just goes right but yeah there. I feel like um I don't know I don't know how long I'm gonna have this wig I know if um, I need another one I'm gonna get another one the price is like really good um, typically I just wear the hair like this I'll put some of it like behind my back just grab just a little and put some of it behind my back just a little okay put a little more in the front showing the long pieces a little bit in the front okay okay yeah i told y'all i get a little tingly but it's cool though it's not nothing that you can't manage okay Y'all, this hair is just so beautiful. Like, I can't take it. And as, as you can see, it did not take me that long to do this hair. And you guys, this top, if you're wondering where I got this top, I got this top from Boohoo. Shout out to Boohoo. Because, you know, I get a lot of my clothes from Boohoo. And this is so cute. I really thought it was just like a regular bodysuit, but it kind of got that little lining right here to show like it's like a, I don't know, um, what they call those? Like a... Brown oh, no. but yes you guys so this is the look okay the parting this is a party I did pluck it just a little bit but you don't really have to pluck the parting too much you'll be just fine. yes you guys so that is gonna be the end of this video make sure you go ahead and subscribe to this channel make sure you hit that like button if you did enjoy this video and make sure you also hit the like button for this hair because this hair is bomb okay let's go ahead and get this video to about let's just say 50 likes again make sure you go ahead and comment below let me know what you guys think of this hair let me know if you would get it in another color let me know if black is your color because i really think black brings out the definitions and everything in your skin um yeah just let me know what you guys think of this hair and thank you for watching and i will see you in my next video